Laura and AJ Hammer. Welcome to the Showbiz Tonight podcast. This is where we go inside Hollywood's biggest stories. And right now, breaking beauty barriers. There is a beauty queen who is turning the pageant world upside down. It's Molly Thomas, who is one of the first openly lesbian contestants in the Miss California USA pageant. And now, her groundbreaking move is inspiring women everywhere. Here's Showbiz Tonight's Kareem Winter with this Showbiz special report. Who can forget Sandra Bullock's physical transformation in Miss Congeniality, playing an undercover FBI agent posing as a beauty queen, and experiencing all that goes along with it? Real-life beauty pageant contestant Molly Thomas can definitely relate. I just learned how to put on two pairs of false eyelashes. In just three months, Molly polished her look, studied up on pageants, and joined the race for Miss California USA. And along with 26-year-old Janelle Hutcherson, became the first openly gay women to compete in the 60-year history of the contest. I wanted to put out a real person that someone could really say, I can relate to this girl. Molly's on a mission to disprove painful stereotypes out there about gay women, like we saw in Miss Congeniality, when Sandra Bullock's free makeover looks and traits led to this question. Honey. Are you a lesbian? So many people have this image of what a lesbian is, and if you don't fit that, you can't possibly be gay. Um, I grew up with the comment of, you're too pretty to be gay. There is no there is no such thing as too pretty to be gay. So not for the cash or the crown, but to make her point, the 19-year-old student ran openly gay in her first ever beauty pageant. It's never been done before, and anything new is always scary. And Molly tells Chauvis tonight, the risk was worth it. I had my phone out all weekend because it was going nonstop, and uh, just interviews and press and media. Molly just hopes her story inspires others to be themselves and she admires women who are openly gay in the prime of their career. Women like movie star Amber Heard. I'm from Connecticut. My boyfriend's making this speech. Heard, who co-starred with Johnny Depp in The Rum Diary, is an inspiration to Molly. The actress, who was also named the face of Guess's fall fashion campaign, went public with her sexual orientation in 2010. She later told the gay pop culture website after Ellen, If you hide something, you're inadvertently admitting it's wrong. I don't feel like I'm wrong. I don't feel like millions of people are wrong because they love who they love or they were born how they were born. Molly says she's not interested in hiding either. And the Miss Universe organization, which runs the Miss USA pageant, was happy to have her center stage, telling Showbiz Tonight, the Miss Universe organization embraces diversity, and we look forward to the day when a woman's sexual orientation, religion, or race is no longer newsworthy. So I just finished my first pageant. So while Molly didn't win the title of Miss California USA her first go-round, she tells Showbiz Tonight that she's going to run again next year. I'm honored to be in the position that I am and to be able to speak up for what I really believe in. Where she'll continue to wear a sash to make a statement. Showbiz Tonight now seen exclusively weeknights at 11 p.m. Eastern and Pacific on HLN. Thanks for watching the Showbiz Tonight podcast. I'm A.J. Hammer.